Go. It truly was a historic day, and you could feel it during the speech. This was a hard-fought battle, and this was Congresswoman Karen Bass's moment to celebrate, but it will be a very short honeymoon. Congresswoman Karen Bass making her first appearance as the next projected mayor of L.A. A historic moment, the first woman and black woman set to hold the job. Bass took it all in as she was introduced as LA's next mayor. I, I do have to say, I kind of have to say that a couple of times for it to really sink in. Surrounded by family, friends, and supporters at the iconic Ebell Theater in Mid Wilshire, Congresswoman Bass acknowledged she doesn't have a lot of time to bask in victory. Her first day is just weeks away, December 12th. The view of a transition team to me won't be a three week transition team. It'll be a transition team that goes into the administration after uh, the swearing in. And shortly after swearing in, the homeless crisis will be top of the agenda. On day one, and day one is December 12th, I will declare a state of emergency. We will identify very specific areas where we will get people housed. Bass talked about how the late Congressman John Lewis helped inspire her journey, the power of coalition building, and she also acknowledged the weight of what she has accomplished. It's sinking in. <laughs> it's sinking in. The magnitude of the job is sinking in and the historical significance. But to me, when you do make history, when you're in a position like this, and I was in a similar position when I was sworn in as speaker, it means that you have extra responsibility. Bass's supporters also feeling hope and excitement. I feel so proud, not only that we've elected the first woman, black woman mayor of the city of Los Angeles, but somebody who has a track record supporting all communities. I think she's perfectly equipped for the job with all of the work that she's done over the years. Another major issue Bass will have to contend with right away, the controversy still simmering at City Hall in the wake of that racist recording scandal. I keep calling on my colleague uh, Kevin to, to turn the page for himself and turn the, let the city turn the page. If he comes back to council, can you still work with him or can, can the council still work with him? It, it's, a, it's a difficult working situation should he decide to return. Bass says she had a good conversation with her opponent, Rick Caruso, and she said she knows he cares about Los Angeles. Bass also said she welcomes Caruso voters in every aspect of her administration.